On here at Monaco, the times look good at the end of the day. How is the car to drive though? Uh, it is different, very different to what we've been driving the last few years around here. Uh, the important thing is that we are competitive, that we are feeling uh, pretty good for the challenge that it is. Uh, the cars are a lot more all over the place, a lot trickier with the bumps, with the curbs. But uh, yeah, the important thing is that it seems like the others are struggling even more. So uh, yeah, good challenge ahead of us. What is it about your car that's made it adaptable, malleable to this circuit? No, I guess we seem to be working the tires well and at the same time we seem to have a decent level of grip, uh, which is the important thing around here, no? Then it seems like the ride, the bumps, the curbs, seems to be like it's a challenge for everyone. And what does that feel like? The roller coaster kind of feeling more like a bit of an earthquake going on all the time in the in the car, but uh, yeah, getting used to it, the visibility, the the um, yeah, the the way to attack each corner with how the bumps upset you is 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 a new challenge, as I said. And uh, yeah, it's I'm enjoying it, but at the same time, it's you need to keep an eye on everything. Is there anything you can do to the car to make that easier, or is it just changing driving style and adapting to to the track? Uh, well, obviously, we take setup compromises, but uh, softening up this year's cars are you pay a price in downforce too, so it's not like you. There's always a, a trade there to, to be made, no? Uh, while on the other hand, on the driving style, you just need to, to live with it, live with the, with the unsettling of the bumps and find ways to, to, even if the car bounces around a lot, still be confident with it.